expressing general actions versus expressing specific actions. Compare the following two sentences. A doctor examines the patients and a doctor is examining a patient. The present simple is used to express general actions. For example, a doctor examines patients. In this example, a doctor's job in general is to examine patients. All doctors examine patients. There is no individual doctor, no specific place, and no specific time. On the other hand, the present continuous is used to express specific actions. For example, a doctor is examining a patient. In this example, one doctor is examining one patient at the time of speaking. There is one doctor in a specific situation and in a specific time which at the time of speaking. Now, we can summarize what we have just studied in this video in the following grammatical rule. The present simple is used to express a general action which is not limited to a certain situation, a certain time, or a certain person or thing. On the other hand, the present continuous is used to express a specific action which is limited to a certain person or thing, a certain situation, or a certain time, which is the time of speaking, or a period of time at present.